Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to compare G Suite with Gmail. So the biggest difference between G Suite and Gmail is that in G Suite you can have your own domain. So let's say that I have a company uh, that I'm repairing glass windows. Okay, let's say that. Oh, like roofs. And my company is called rooftiptop.com. What can I do is if I own the domain, I can simply create a simple account called info uh, rooftiptop.com. So I don't have to have the Gmail end there. So that's a biggest difference between uh, G Suite and also Gmail is that on G Suite you can have your own domain and this is really professional and many people are not going to reply to you if you have only Gmail on the end but they are taking you more trustworthy if you actually operate and if you actually have um, your own email address and G Suite can help you with that. So when you come here to so a different also thing is that it's going to cost you money only because the business starter custom and secure business email you're gonna have 30 gigabyte cloud storage per user so if you're gonna have five user uh, you're gonna have like a lot of gigabyte cloud storage security and management controls and standard support for six bucks a month or you have option to go business standard for 12 usd a month and that's two terabytes cloud storage per user so you can see for the 12 bucks a month uh, you're gonna have much more Mm, storage comparing to have a normal gmail account but again you can connect it again with the google sheets google docs google slides google keep uh, google sites google forms and others same with the gmail but you, you have this huge advantage that you can actually connect it with your own domain and that's that's like the biggest 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 difference uh between g suite and also gmail so if you have any questions i'm really happy to help you also you can't actually upgrade from gmail to g suite how it actually works that you need to buy the plan so you just click here get started and just you you just add name roof tip top just you country slovakia you add a first name last name current email address where you would get all your information and then you just simply sign up for the g suite so this is how it works now how it actually works you need to buy and then you need to transfer everything from gmail to g suite you can do it and in that regard it is effective so two differences first difference is that now you're going to have your own domain the second difference is that you're going to have uh and own a lot of more gigabyte storage that you can actually manage and that's pretty much it so thank you very much guys for watching if you have any questions i'm really happy to help you and provide you some guidance and have a great day and goodbye see ya